So yo guys, we're on our way to the London card show and as you can see we are selling here Famous Grail, check it out guys, but yo, we got a ton of cool stuff today that we brought down. As you can see, we go with the slabs, we got a ton of slabs, we got the ponchos, festers, Van Gogh, all our Charizards, Rainbow Charizards, we got the, all the Pikachu promos there, uh, we got the waifus including Sightseer, Cynthia, tons of awesome slabs here today guys, including a load of alts there, we got the signed Pikachus by Veronica Taylor, One Piece alt art, Worlds promos from London and Yokohama. We've got an array of stuff as you can see, ARs, rainbows, golds, full arts from XY, GX. Then we've got like the Thai 25th anniversary classic collection there as well, Japanese. But yo, and then we've got Eevee Heroes, Alt Arts, and we've got the Umbreon from Evolving Skies as well. And then boom, over here we got our binder selection. So yeah, we've got a few binders. We'll show you what we brought down today. And as you can see, we've got a few different categories. So yo, starting off, we've got a Chinese binder. So if you don't know, Chinese cards are printed in Japan. We've got shinies, rainbows, full art, uh, tons of stuff. And like, I think we've got Chinese cards, full art cards from three pounds, incredible value in there. We've got the Yokohama merch, as you can see in the Detective Pikachu game in Japanese as well. And then boom, over here, we have the Pikachu binder, one of my favorite binders, because you've got tons of Pikachu promo cards, as well as in this binder, we do have some other promos, including McDonald's promos and Magic promos as old as like 2000, 3004, I think. So, yeah, some incredible older promos in there. Um, we got the Reggie Rock, some of these amazing promos. And yo, then we get into our vintage binder that we have for sale. As you can see, we've got Dark Charizard, Crystal Guardian Charizard, we've got EXs, E Series, we've got Level Xs, Primes, all of that. And yo, we got 996 Base, Jungle, Fossil, Rocket, and also Gym. And then we have some Neo stuff as well. And then we got, oh, there's a bit of XY, I don't know where to put those, but then yeah, some English vintage or oh, bits, bobs there as well. Uh, but yeah, nice little vintage binder, some incredible deals in there, guys. Do not sleep when we do bring these along. But yeah, £4 a hollow, black and white. Each one of these are only £4 a card from the black and white era. Over 300 hollows in this binder to pick from. And yeah. And over here, we have our like mix of array of stuff. As you can see, we've got Paladin Fates, the latest set. These are generally stuff from my uh, openings and pulls. So you can buy the cards I've packed on these on this channel at the events. And here you've got some shiny treasure EX as well, the Japanese equivalent. And you've got the Iono for 200 pounds there. And yeah, just like I said, array of my pulls as well. So you got a bunch of other stuff. You got the uh, Roy Moon, Altaria, Erica. Uh, some incredible stuff in there. So yeah, nice little gems, great, great prices. You got a classic collection Japanese in there. And then boom at the back, we have the old arts from One Piece. One Piece is really popping off right now. So yeah, as you can see, a lot more old arts from our openings because we've been opening a lot more of that recently. Uh, but yeah, let's go. So yo, we got our sealed products here. As you can see, we got some Paladin Fates the latest sets, including some of the latest products. But we got 151 Japanese, Lakana, the new Cyber and Wild sets there. We got the One Piece Japanese. We got Waishwa's Avatar. And I think this one's gonna pop off this month because obviously the Netflix movie of that's coming out. We got the One Piece Bandai card. We got some Korean packs, and obviously we have a lot of different international languages. As you can see, we've got Indonesian, traditional Chinese, uh, Thai, and obviously Japanese as well. And then we got some Union Arena, and yeah, we got a lot more boxes couldn't fit all on the table today and then we also got this watsy 2001 movie cards from harry potter and then yeah obviously load of english packs being an official retailer we got lots of english we got Yu-Gi-Oh there and yeah definitely check out our website if you want to see more of this as well and then yo we got collection boxes we got more japanese one piece we got the more avatar yeah bits and bits starling good 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 what, what, what we sold what i've sold so far so the biggest one we've sold so far is the thai charizard okay. it's a 10 20th anniversary i can't go wrong so oh. Yeah, not bad. Some of the mysteries have gone already. Ooh. So they're people playing that. So we got some mystery slab pulls, including this Palkia GX Secret from Japanese in the midnight. And then we also got a V Star Universe Charizard and a 25th anniversary uh, Magneton Hollow. Now we're going to go around and obviously we've got to stop off at Collectible Power because they always have an incredible display of products. As you can see, all these black and white boxes, Evolution, you've got Plasma Storm, Stormfront there. And as you can see, we've got a complete set. Ruby and Sapphire, we've got Aquapolis, Expedition, we've got Neo sets, we've got Gym, we got even Base Set 2. So yeah, incredible sets there, complete sets, Minty as well. And yo, you even got 996 Charizard graded and then tons of slabs as you can see. And yo, as you can see here, we've got blisters, vintage blisters, we've got EX era blisters, we've got Diamond and Pearl blisters. Incredible stuff. Maybe one day we can open one of those on the channel. <laughs> one day, maybe. Uh, but yeah, in the binder, we've got Shinings, Gold Stars, and obviously, look at the booster boxes, guys. Base set, Rocket, Fossil, and yo, there's so much here. Crystal, Shinings, First Edition, and but yeah, look, you even got Fossil, you got Rocket, Jungle, 
and a little bit of Scarlet and Violet. But yo, Gold Stars here, Reggie Rock, Reggie Steel. You got the Ladios and more Shinings base Zards there. They got, like I said, they have a ton of bangers on display. And as you can see in this graded cabinet, you got some big ones here. As you can see, they got even more slabs over here. And if you come down here, you can see there's a first edition Venusaur, Gyarados, and a Nita King Crystal Zard, Wild Blaze, Full Art, and Secret, Gold Star, Mudkip, and Ladios. EX Rockets, a Snorlax, you got Shining Mewtwo and Gold Star Mewtwo up there, and some more Charizards. Now we're at Gavizard's table here. He runs Cardiff Card Show, and yo, he's brought some heat today. As you can see, we've got some classic collection English, some cool stuff in the binders, but in the back, we got a Gold Star Charizard, Shining Charizard, and a Shining Gyarados, guys. Some incredible stuff there. One day I need the Shining Charizard, I haven't got one yet. Now we're at Card Galaxy's table, and they got some cool stuff, including our Charmander McDonald's, which I really need, some awesome Pikachu promos, including the anniversary one, Uniqlo Pikachu, one day we'll need to grab that as well, uh, but yeah, nice array of singles, like all sorts of promos here, and cards from different sets, you got trainers, Japanese trainers, Japanese SARs from 151, and an array of Master Balls, as you can see here, absolutely blinging, uh, but yeah, SARs, all arts from the Sun and Moon era as well, and Sword and Shield, then we got some XY full arts, including our Lucario, which looks amazing. And then you also have the Charizard base set, CD promo there, Venusaur. Now we're at Brotherhood Games, which has like one of the best Pokemon shops in London. So check them out, guys. But let's see what they have. Obviously, they got an array of slabs in this display. As you can see, we've got uh, Chonkachu, we've got Van Gogh Pikachu, Old Art Dialga uh, Palkia Arceus. Just a right and look, look at those shinings from Call of Legends. Y'all need that Dialga, Entei there. And your gold stars at the top, Japanese, Suicune, Mewtwo, Celebi, Groudon SL at the top as well. And you some waifus as well. We got some Master Balls, Base Set Zard, Rocket Zard. And then we also have your One Piece Alt Arts for the One Piece fans. Let me know if you're collecting One Piece right now. But yeah, they got a ton of Alt Arts here. And then boom, we also have a Spanish Base Set Pack and also a Dark Dragonite Era next to that where it says five which should be the hollow but it's a non-hollow so that's a cool error and yeah you got some watsy hollows a ton of it look at this they have pretty much every single watsy hollow and they have a ton of it including the basic charizard blastoise uh so yeah if you need a watsy hollow check them out and boom over here you have obviously the brotherhood games like iconic card display full of cards full of single cards and yeah, you recognize these in a couple of events. But yeah, you got tons of rainbows, golds there. On this side, you have like full arts, ARs, and yeah, just some cool stuff, modern stuff, nice bits. And on this side, we have some Paldian Fates shinies, include that Pikachu there, Entei, uh, and yo, full arts 151, SARs in there as well. Yo, we got Chibi Collectibles right here, the legend. And yo, he's got a ton of One Piece right now. And yo, we got Babsy just picked up the Dream League box. And yo, let's see what we got here. As you can see, you got your One Piece alts and all that. But as you can see, just a ton of alts from various different sets, promos, etc. Over here, you got your Pokemon, you got your waifus, Cheras alts. And then here, slabs, you got alts, Pikachus, Worlds promos, Uniqlo, Festers. So some beautiful stuff in that one. And yeah, you got binders full of stuff. He's got a ton of singles, including alt arts, level X's, vintage. And yeah, obviously, you know, Chibi with the plushies. <laughs> that rhymes, but yeah. Chibi with the plushies there, and also the Pikachu binder as well. We got the Mario Pikachus here, which I'll have a video soon on that one. But yo, as you see, a lot of my champ base sets there. You got your base sets in the binder as well. Yo, you got Lugia, Old Art, you got a Rocket Folder there. Some nice vintage uh, Burger King and some vintage comics, as you can see, signed by the original voice actors of Brock, uh, Meowth, uh, etc. And yeah, the other ones are unsigned, but yo, very vintage, nostalgic comics um, here. So let me know if you do remember these ones as well. Lots of vintage today at this event, as you can see, lots of vintage hollows and stuff like that. You got some packs there as well. Great comic there. And over here, you got some Pokerev packs. Shout out to Pokerev. And yo, these Poncho plushies look amazing. Really need one of those one day. But yo, did pick up this Zard from them, so shout out to them. So yo, over here, more vintage slabs, guys. And also, you got that Ultra Shiny GX Cherizard. You got the Nintendo World Pichu, which I absolutely love as well. But yeah, that Mewtwo EX one, I really trying to pick up this year. So that very nice card there. Yeah, that Latios as well. That is, that is the one on my top of my list right now. But yeah, lots of slabs. And yeah, tons of singles, including like Cherizards. You got some alts. You got rainbows, of course. But yeah, they have a lovely array of singles, including Rainbow Charizard, only 65, which is crazy right now. Now, Ladias, 
with the stamp holland phantoms absolutely beautiful with the charmander from mcdonald's uh you got level x zard you got some full arts really nice array and variety there but yo over here you have this bulk sorting machine which costs you a ton i don't even know how much it costs but it costs a ton of money but yeah it's pretty much sorts of bulk for you as you can see here literally sorting it out you, you choose what you want like it sorts out the playables out the bulk and valuable cards out the bulk obviously all down to your settings yo over here we got some cards right up my street as you can see we got that skull poncho there we got the rayquaza poncho 9.5 bgs and yeah awesome cards here including the lucario poncho outbreak pikachu some sealed here including the kanazawa box and you also got this Pikachu plushie, which holds the card. You can put a card in there and put it on display. The array of Japanese boxes. We got all arts. We got shinies, rainbow zard, and yo, crazy, crazy singles. So many beautiful stuff here, including the ultra shiny GX Charizard, Pikachu, Lucario Punch. I love that one. And you got that Soljali Nala there. And a black label picks up. And yo, we're actually collectibles. And as you can see, he's already got the shiny treasure EX Charizard graded, but he always has the Japanese bangers. As you can see, we've got the Ladias Ladios, Pikachu Anniversary promo, Pikachu promos on the top, Psyduck Munch promo, Alt Arch Dragonite Charizard, SARs there, and some beautiful promos as well. And in here, as you can see, you got vintage Japanese cards, uh, a ton of it as well. Master Balls graded, Waifus graded, SARs, Erika, you've got the Lucia. Rosa, Marnie, so some incredible cards there. Yeah, this Charmander McDonald's promo has been following me all day. So yeah, PSA 10 there though. Uh, but yeah, tons of awesome cool cards in here, as well as we have some Japanese pack. Shout out to Trust Grading. Yo, he's here as well with Ashley. And yeah, we got the Poncho Charizard box for 3.2k. So yeah, if anyone's feeling that, hit him up. But yeah, very nice box there, as well as we got some Japanese chocolate boxes in time for the Valentine's Day as well as some mini boxes there and then you also got like a little uh, wash bag from japan all japanese exclusive so that's pretty nice and now we're with uncle babsy who has you guys know he's he's a legend with the one piece and you know as you can see we've got the manga we've got the signature oda luffy zoro manga ace manga and we've got the nami second print nami op01 or as well as the nami op05 sp alt as well he also has these awesome custom cards so if you're ever interested hit him up but yeah as you can see that rayquaza v max pikachu like what you call it shadow boxes he does them as well we got gad and emp collects they come through to my table show me this espion gold star japanese i think they told me it's worth like five figures so let me know would you spend five figures on this card but yeah absolute cool to see this in person now we've got two infinity and yo you see him always at these events but as you can see he's got the pretend imposter pikachus you got the rainbow lugia you got the moon brion flare on gold star you got the pikachu yokohama promo and yes yeah, incredible slabs including gold star gyarados base Zard, charizard promos uniqlo pikachu which is one of my favorites and yeah you got the saparo you got shadowless legendary collections seeing a lot of those today but yes as you can see they got an array of binders so many binders but yeah, over here you got vintage packs and now we're at collector's card house as you can see we've got loads more packs more pop series we've got platinum arceus we've got evolution sun and moon as well as burning shadows and you've got some get graded graded neo discovery packs and you also have some world championship promos from 2016 and the london ones as well some slabs up there including pikachu you got that ground from dark explorer as well and over here, as you can see, you've got the first edition Charizard, some shiny cards as well from Hidden Fate. We also got that level X Pikachu there from Arceus, which is really nice. A like PSA 10 151 Charizard. And yeah, you got a ton of stuff. You got like Rosa, Marnie, uh, I think a Saito Auto maybe. Uh, even vintage cards, modern, a ton of different graded cards here. And yeah. And over here, you got some Magic Doctor Who, Lord of the Rings. And yeah, shout out to Collectors Card House. And then boom, over here we got all their packs and stuff like that. And as you can see, we've got them black and white tins with the starters from the black and white era, which is nice. Some vintage tins there. And they also have some awesome resources, Burning Shadows, Evolutions, Ancient Origins, Forbidden Light. We've got some modern ones at the bottom there. Shout out to Poke Dean Zetro there. And then over here, they got Shining Legends, Pallio Fates, ETBs, as well as some vintage Watsy decks, which I actually picked up from one from them recently. Boom, I did pick up this Dark Explorers Groudon, one of my favorite cards from the black and white era. Shout out to Harry for doing a deal on this one and boom origin came over to my table to show me this first edition lugia from neo genesis in a 9.5 and yeah absolute crazy card big money 
So at Kado Cars, they have the uh, Battle Box Pikachu and Aloha friends. I don't know why. I still don't know why I didn't buy those when they came out. But yo, some amazing, incredible Japanese cards, Japanese promo cards here. As you can see, including Cherries like Latios, one of my favorites. You got that Iono Flareon EX, the Spiky Eared Pichu, Meganium EX there. And yeah, even some banned cards, including that Misty and Moo Moo Milk. Uh, but yeah, SAR there, you got the Psyduck, and look at the Iono, SAR 809.5. And boom, I did pick up this from Third Down Display. Shout out to them, it's like a cleaning kit, like a crap protector for your cards. Uh, so yeah, I thought I'd buy and try it out. And I also got these from them, some custom stands, one with my logo. So shout out to them for that. And then I bought this one with the uh, Famous Grail. I got it done and they dropped it to me at the show. And then yo, we got my boy Pokey Stew in the building. Shout out to Pokey Stew, the absolute legend. Let's see what we got here. As you can see, we got Lakana, we got booster boxes, we got binders. Pretty much got all the cool stuff. You got like a rock, uh, off like rock shaped Pokemon, I think. Uh, but yeah, Meta Zoo there, RIP to the Meta Zoo gang. But yeah, One Piece double boxes there. And yo, we over here we got a Retro Goods and Sport Shack, my guys here. As you can see, we got that Brock Sun and Moon box there. We got Sun, even Cosmic Eclipse booster box. That is pretty sick. A chilling Rain, load of booster boxes. Dragon Ball. You got Van Gogh Pikachu's there. Uh, Unbroken booster box there, as well as you got One Piece. Even some graded packs. These look actually so so sick. I need to do these eventually. But yeah, that looks really sick. All tens. And over here we have the Poncho Charizard and Rayquaza's all PSA 10s as well as many many awesome cards including the special delivery Pikachu, you got Detective Pikachu there, some sports stuff as well and then over here we have my guy Sard's cards and as you can see he's also got a Poncho Pikachu and some Mario Luigi's including some Panini ones, Disney cards there, he does a lot of sports cards as you can see and yeah. He also has some Disney 100 Tops Chrome cards as well. And yo, over here we got Amir Collect. Shout out to Amir Collect. He always has the bangers. As you can see, he has a ton of Japanese stuff. A ton. <laughs> you guys already know. If you know, you know. But yeah, shout out to Amir. Yo, tons of awesome goodies here. Over here we got like Cherizard's Crystal, CD Prime, and then we got some Evolutions. But over here, guys, bro, we got Ladios, Vapor, and Mewtwo, Pikachu Gold Stars. Then you got these Pokemon Center promos, Gold Star Groudon chilling there. You got Pikachu promos, Shining, Lugia, Aquapolis. Uh, Sweet Coon, you got like McDonald's promos, you got E Series, Holo Res there. So, yeah, some incredible, incredible vintage stuff. I love that Ente. But, yeah, lovely gold stars. And then, boom, more Halakazam. You even have that Dialga Palkia promo, Shinings, Gold Star Kyogre, Shining Mewtwo Celebi. Over here, we got like Level X's, EX's, including that Mewtwo. Uh, as well, and you got some like reverse holo EX era stuff like that Blastoise, a uh, ton of EX's, Deoxy, Jirachi, uh, Gardevoir there. Yo, Ente, gotta love that Rocky Ente, but boom, lovely stamped promos, legend cards, well, one half of them. Boom, we're at the Ace Boo. Shout out to Ace Grading. They have their own store here showcasing some of their cards and how they look with the Ace label slabs. You know how it is. And also, they also take submissions. But yeah, they do all sorts. Obviously, Pokemon, One Piece, Digimon, Dragon Ball, Lakana, Magic the Gathering. They grade them all. And yeah, shout out to them. If you do want to grade with them, use the code VIV on Ace Grading. Grading, as you can see. I uh, hope they don't mind me using the computer. But uh, grading starts from £10. So you get 5% off with the code VIV. Uh, and yeah, some examples, awesome display, awesome booth, and look at this, Charizard, how it looks in an ace slab from Evolution's full art. So yo, shout out to Pokey Coops here, as you can see, he's always got the bangers, guys. I actually did pick up a big card of him at the beginning of the year, but check it out on my Instagram, guys. But yo, lots and lots of cool stuff from all sorts of stuff. You've got vintage, modern, you've got first edition there, some crazy stuff. And then obviously, if you know Pokey Coops, man, he loves his Disney 100 cards. So he's got them all, autographs, parallels, he's got them all. And then we've got Pokey List here, shout out to Pokey List. As you can see, we've got some bangers, including CD Promo, EXs, Gary Dose, Shadowless, uh, and yeah, some beautiful legendary collection cards. Look at the way they shine, but yo, Neo cards there. Uh, and yeah, nice vintage cards. And yo, this Neo Entei is like one of my chase cards this year. So hopefully we can pick up a nice mint one this year. And yo, we got PM1 here. You know him. He's always got the bangers. Honestly, so much bangers. As you can see, you got a Manga Luffy worth over like, I don't even know what a 10 worth for like six grand. Poncho, Skull, Pikachu, Van Gogh. You even got World's promos there. Like some incredible stuff. I look at that. Manga. I think he pulled it himself, which is incredible, but loads of rainbows in the display. All arts, full arts, all sorts of awesome cards, guys. And that's not it. Another side to it, as you can see, got some awesome cards. I really like this one. It's like a non holo E series card, but the artwork's just so sick. It's like bulk, but it looks so good. I need one of those. Uh, but yeah, full arts. You got Lily, you got so many bangers, even some awesome vintage era kind of like Japanese cards there. And yeah, so many slides. You just come in the cases, but. 
yeah as you can see pikachu promos mario is just chilling in there as you can see mario poncho pikachu you got the set of them like i said next month you might see a mario pikachu video on the channel so stay tuned for that guys but yeah so yeah he let me show you the luffy manga card in all its glory in the light and yo it is incredible the way if you ever see a manga in person the way it shines is just incredible but yeah this is worth over three grand raw i think like six grand in the ten so yeah, awesome card so over here we have ubank auctions they're like an auction house but they have this like french german italian neo destiny shining set and all like nines and tens which is pretty sick uh, and then you have some like vintage comics and then they also have this uncut fossil sheet it's always interesting to see how the cards look before they were cut and yeah this is a, i'll give you guys a close-up at this but yeah look at that you can see like the alignment dot there and it's just so weird to look at it but this is all available in the auction they haven't and i thought i'd show you give you a nice close-up but yeah fossil uncut sheet guys um, would you frame it or would you cut them and put them in your binder? I'm joking, I'll definitely keep that up. And yeah, we have Golden Auctions. They're like an auction house in America, which are over here. And they have some really expensive cards on display to show you uh, that I think they have in auctions coming up. But yeah, as you can see, you got LeBron and Michael Jordan order. You got a Pele rookie, probably. Uh, you also have this Chrome Charizard, which goes for a lot in the 10. You got Messi from World Cup. You got a Shadowless Charizard, uh, Lewis Hamilton RPA. You got a Trophy Kangaskhan. You got some hockey. And you also got this tennis uh, card. They also had some vintage Yu-Gi-Oh. Let me know if anyone remembers these ones, but some vintage Yu-Gi-Oh there, as well as some European language, Crystal Guardian and Unseen Forces booster boxes sealed. Yo, I did get this Rainbow 10. Pikachu. Uh, I know Vivid Voltage is a bit boring now, but I didn't have a 10. I had three nines, so I traded it for one of those uh, Veronica's Taylor signed cards. But yeah, I'm glad I can add one to the collection finally. Uh, and then, yo, I also bought some Digimon old arts, man. Digimon is so slept on. Used to love it as a kid. And, yo, the old arts, look at this. One pound for this, and it's got the crazy textures. Obviously, you don't know Digimon. Digimon's made by, like, Bandai, uh, which makes One Piece and Dragon Ball. So, you got the same textures. you got the same quality. Amazing, amazing cards. You even have these classic collection cards, which are, like, the original reprint, but with modern textures. Like, only six, seven quid. Look, look at this card. Agumon. Oh, and look at the textures for only four pounds. But yeah, do not sleep on Digimon. If you used to like it as a kid, definitely pick up some awesome cards like two pounds se second anniversary stamped promos. Absolutely crazy. Yo, we got my guy Volt Maximus. Shout out to him, guys. Absolute legend. And yo, he bought another mystery slab. He always loves the mystery slabs. Let's see what we got here. Ooh, we got Avrin. Well, great. PSA 9 secret Japanese for only 20 pounds. Mystery grade cards available on famousgirl.com, guys. Do not sleep. We got some bangers right now. So, boom, trade night right now. So, it's where everyone can trade. But yo, shout out to DJ because I traded this Pikachu character rare for. This Charmander has been eyeing me up all day, but yeah, shout out to DJ for the deal. I'm joking, I did add some cash on top as well. So yo, I did pick up these One Piece Chinese promos from my guy Quartz Collectibles, so shout out to him as well. There was this 15th anniversary Pikachu box for only 1.5K, I was so tempted. So yeah, shout out to my guy, I can never know how to pronounce your name, bro. But as you can see, he's always got the world's promos. You got the 20, 15, 13, 16, 17. You got the Yokama 2023 as well. And then you got some Skyridge Hollows. As you can see, you got the Zatu Dugong, but yo, 2015's got all the languages. You got a good deal, so hit him up if you want them. But Zatu, Skyridge, Gengar, Skyridge, and a nine, Gyarados there as well. And then you got your Fest Up Pikachu there and a PSA 10. And then you got some CGC get graded cards. You got all sorts in this CGS. I don't know what they are, but oh, yo, I just had to show off my boy Champagne Pikachu's pickup. Not mine, but his, but Narita Mute 20th anniversary. Absolutely crazy. So yo, it's actually day two Sunday right now. Uh, and yeah, I saw this awesome ace graded uh, manga there. And then as you can see, we've got some awesome vintage cards in this binder. So well as Pikachu promos, including the Blossom Pikachu. Uh, you got the Ash Pikachu from the Mewtwo movie, the Lucario Pikachu, which is always a banger as well. And then we've got my guy Trident Cards. Shout out to Trident Cards. You already know Trident Cards, guys. The absolute legend. We did a sh video at his shop. So check it out. But yeah, he's got an array of stuff. As you can see, EXs, Gold Stars, Level Xs. Vintage Watsy, oh, that Holland Phantoms, Latios, absolute banger with the stamp, but even Legendary Collections, E Series stuff as well. And then over here, he is big into the One Piece, shout out to him, but he's got all these Championship Series cards, some incredible stuff. And yo, even the Nami, absolute crazy promo there. Uh, and yeah, we've got a load of modern stuff. And then yeah, I did pick up these two Championship cards as well. So yeah, not too bad as well as you got loads of slabs, you got Eevee Poncho. As you can see, you need to get some of those this year. And you also got so like Iona SAR, you got Cherazards there, you got as you can see, guys. But yo, you even got 
even more stuff included in One Piece. They love One Piece, so you got that. So you got the mangas graded by Ace. You got some BGS, Nami, some winner cards as well. You got a, even like a serialized Shanks card and a first print Nami as well for £1,000 and £5,000 there. Uh, but yeah, amazing old arts in this display as well. Some incredible cards. And yeah, you even got loads, loads more slabs. You got binders, you got tins, products, uh, play mats. And also in the back, this is awesome older box and a lower collection box. You got some awesome Japanese boxes as well. And then boom, over here, you got some Japanese, English, even Ultra Genesis, Matches Fighter. You got the 151 Pressure Collection box. One Piece Japanese and English there as well. And then lots of Lakana. So yo, I picked up this. Portuguese, I believe. Cherizard Secret from Flash Fire from Grind and Hustle. So shout out to them. So yo, at this booth, as you can see, we've got some like Portuguese Ruby and Sapphire packs, which are pretty cool. And then you got some full art trainers, Japanese in the Clef and Lily promo. And then you got these Builder Bear promos. I didn't realize how low pop these are. Pop four, he doesn't even know what the price is. And he's even got the Evo League Mew promo. So one to fourth in a 10 sequential set, which is nice. But he's been a Builder Bear promo is really, really nice. Love the Pikachu ones. I have some myself. Uh, but yeah, loads of cool stuff. You got loads of Japanese boxes, like a whole array of boxes. And look at the prices now these days. But yeah, Johto GX box as well. Very nice. Another card I got in the trade was a Mew EX. I think I traded for another Veronica Taylor. They are super popular at the show. Uh, but yeah, neither one for the collection. But yo, boom, shout out to Ramsey from my YouTube membership Discord, the best Pokemon community. If you want to join the best Pokemon community, join my YouTube membership Discord, guys. We have a nice positive community. And yeah, we help each other out. Join. But yeah, while he opens this, I thought I'd plug it. But yeah, what does he got in the mystery slab, guys? Let's see. Hey, a Charizard V Star. Not too bad. Hopefully, you enjoy it, bro. Let's go. And yo, we got my guy Prometheus and got him here. And yo, these guys absolutely have heat. Look at these Poncho Evolutions, the Ombre on there. Yo, there we go. <laughs> Plugging it away. But yo, some beautiful cards, including Secret Rare Charizard, SARs, Waifus. Uh, some lovely EXs, Staff, Snorlax, that is incredible. But yeah, seeing a lot of these full art XY cards and black and white cards, like it seems like a surge in pop uh, popularity recently. So yeah, keep an eye out on those guys. But yo, but yeah, as you can see, we've got some Pikachu promos up there, old arts, EXs, Charizards, of course. And then you've got some Legendary Collection reverses, some nice slabs, including that Shine Legends Mewtwo, really, really nice. And then yeah, got some cool ones there, like the Mew, you've got the Gear 5 Luffy. They got the Gala Friends Shining Charizards there, but then in the back, they got like some cool boxes. Uh, like your common deck, you got the Full Metal Wall, you got the OP04 double box, you got the high class deck where you can get the old art Gengar in there and stuff. And yeah, some cool Japanese box up there. But yo, and yo, we got Global Nostalgia here, and he's obviously got like a team streaming on one table where he's selling on the rest, which is pretty cool, different in the event today. But we got some Arita Autos here, I think that's like a no rarity Charizard as well. And then you got some more bangers down below. As you can see with the green exploration full art. We've got some other stuff. Like we haven't seen much other TCGs. We've got some other random bits and bobs here, including some Dragon Ball Yu-Gi-Oh, of course. Uh, but some other stuff as well. And over here we've got great packs. As you can see, we've got the Legends pack there. We've got the Crystal Guardian uh Japanese, we've got Jungle, Neo Discovery, and yeah, some cool stuff here, including some Watsiera Hollows, and you got the Evolutions and the more graded vintage cards in this cabinet, including some Worlds cards there as well. And then we've got binders of stuff, we've got the Nature GX box there. Uh, but yo, lots and lots of cool vintage stuff in the binders, all sorts of errors. And yeah, more vintage, you got Primes there, you got some EXs, you got the What's the error as well? So over here we've got some crazy stuff. We've got like Diamond and Pearl, we've got a Tops movie, first movie packs, Call of Legends, Pokemon movie, 2000, Tops packs, Jungle, Leaf Green, Fire Red, I think Magma uh, packs as well. We've got some vintage decks and boxes and tins and stuff. As you can see, those What's the error decks, very nostalgic. Let me know if you remember those guys. But yo, this, I remember these sort of things, like the Panini Jodo League. Yo, these little things, like, those were so nostalgic. There was all sorts of stuff in that era, right? But some vintage old-looking magic box. Some other stuff as well, like, look at that. Very old stuff there. And, yeah, as you can see, an uh, array of vintage packs from EX to base to diamond. And, yeah, we've got some more cool top stuff at the bottom. you got, like, this EX Deoxys box there. So, yeah, some really nice variety here. So, pretty cool. But, yeah, that is the London Card Show. Two days, day in a life of a collector. At the show showing you what you could pick up and what was there. Guys, let me know in the next videos what you want to see. And make sure to like and subscribe for future card show events in the UK and worldwide.